Hey, what is up, YouTube? This is Red Card 200. We got a different uh, type of video today. First of its series, we got Plat It or Skip It. Um, before we kind of get into the, the grind of what the video is about, uh, let me thank the Lord Jesus Christ for giving me the idea to do something like this. So, uh, for y'all that don't know, I'm a big type trophy hunter, plus, I'm also a big believer of Jesus Christ. So, if you like this video, if you liked it, if you thought it was good, if you like my ideas, the stuff I shared, hopefully you'll give me a chance to maybe talk to you about our lord and savior jesus christ and what i think the whole purpose of life is in my other videos so if you like this one check out my other ones also subscribe to my channel uh comment as well so any type of love that you give me i, I definitely appreciate it thank you very much for the people that actually have given me comments or um let me know uh once i talk to you that you enjoyed my video that actually keeps me going so i appreciate it very much thank you for that so um we actually received uh mad max uh for places playstation plus about two months ago uh i've actually been playing the game even before that it's been on sale for about five dollars so i went ahead and picked that up uh, no regrets uh towards picking it up but uh the whole purpose of the episode is whether you should plat it or just skip it yeah so let me go ahead and give you the result right now okay what i encourage you to do is just skip this game okay and hopefully you take my advice before you actually you know ignore it and just say oh this guy's crazy it's a really good game okay we're not talking in terms of game whether it's good or not i'm just saying that i believe you should skip it okay uh first of all i want to make sure you understand that just because i say skip it doesn't actually mean this game is a bad game it's actually a really good game i had a lot of fun doing it but we're talking in terms of trophies i played a lot of games good games bad games you know awful games just for trophies and i'm kind of out of that stage so i want to make sure i give you the forewarning about this game and i encourage you to just skip this game altogether okay so let me kind of give you for some of you that me, me, never played mad mac let me let you know what the game is about so if you've seen the movie is very similar to that so I give Avalanche a lot of props for making this game uh, really identical to the movie. So, you know, I got to give them props where props are due. Um, so for one, it has a lot of hand-to-hand -hand combat. Very similar to Batman. Very similar to uh, Shadow of Mordor. So if you're very f familiar with those games, you know, this hand-to-hand -hand combat is actually very good. Okay, that for one. For two, has a very good story. Okay, very similar to the movies as well. So if you like the movie, then you'll probably like the game. Yeah. For three, a lot of car combat. Okay, something you really never see before, and that's kind of the bulk of the game because uh, you know you're going around. All these uh, enemies come at you in their car, and they're basically trying to uh, you know destroy your car. Uh, so actually, this really something you really don't see in terms of an open world game. So that is you know really first of its kind that I've never really experienced before. At least I don't remember. So. Um, you know if you like those type of things you know I'll show you clips of those as well if you like those maybe you might want to give this game a chance just like I did okay but we'll t we're talking in terms of trophies okay in terms of trophies we're looking about more than a hundred hours okay or maybe a little bit less than a hundred hours about maybe 90 okay um, and you might say well what's the bulk of this trophy what is you know what's wrong with these trophies well it's just the fact that the map is so huge that you have 200 percent the whole map Okay, I'm going to show you a picture of the map right now and you can actually see how big it is and then I'm going to kind of zoom in and you're going to see all the camps that are within the, the actual map. So you actually have to 100 percent all these all these camps and 100 percent means you go to the camp, you defeat the enemies, you collect the loot and you collect the uh, other little things like a little picture uh, if it might have it or maybe some car parts or maybe some armor and you go ahead and 100 percent it and it'll, it'll let you know when you do that. But you have to do that to every camp. Okay. and that's kind of the bulk of my grind right now you know it is very grindy and you just you know driving around and, and, and unfortunately we, you know it's end of the world type game so there's no, no music and i you know i know it's a fictional game but they, at least i would help out with the grind you know me driving around as you can tell there's no music at all okay and um i would it would be nice that they actually put that in there but okay so you got 100 percent all the caps and for me, uh, it tends to get a little tedious. It, can, it tends to get a little boring, you know, just going to every map and 100% in it. As well, there's different things in the map that you would have to destroy. It was a rocket launcher. Uh, there's some mines that you have to go with a certain car in order to, um, uh, what do you call it, um, disarm the disarm the mines. There's convoys where you have to go by and, you know, you have to destroy all the 
you know all the people in that little squad that they have there's also you know main camps that you have to go by and uh actually uh, you know uh defeat the main enemy that's within that camp which you know could take a little bit of time you know some t some of them are a little difficult than others so it might be a little bit tedious okay so that is the bulk of the grind there and that's currently where i'm at in the game you know all the i've finished the story once you finish the story then you you know you have to deal with the hundred percenting of the game and that is very tedious to me that is very annoying and there's no there's really no more no fun in the game because you've been actually doing this for a good amount of time already so because of that that's one reason why you should skip this game okay so I'm, I'm trying to do you a favor here okay please believe me okay okay so then you're like okay is that it is all you have to do you gotta you know do the camp no after that you actually have to do all the challenges within the map while you're basically doing everything okay challenges are very important because ch uh, certain challenges uh, require for you to have a certain amount of enemies and if you complete the whole game without doing some of the challenges um, you know you're kind of in trouble at that point because there's no more enemies there's not as much enemies for you to complete certain you know because there's certain you know uh, challenge like you know defeat 15 enemies or something in to that form so obviously you need a lot more enemies for your chances to to increase on that so a lot of the game I went ahead and spent checking my challenges you gotta check your challenges you know you gotta make sure you complete your challenges okay and some challenges can't get completed until you find certain parts of the game so because of that you know that is very tedious I don't like playing games where I have to keep checking certain things to make sure I don't miss it because I'm very you know I don't want to go through this trouble and not receive my platinum you know it'd be a waste of time so you spend a lot of your time doing that so once you do the camps once you 100% everything you gotta do your challenges okay oh and I forgot to mention once you're done with your challenge or your camps there might be a chance that your trophy might be glitch out because there's certain there's a certain pictures that you have to receive and because of those pictures there's so many of them that sometimes there's people online saying that you know it didn't pick up one of them and because of that they didn't pick up one of them unfortunately they're kind of screwed with their with their trophy or with their platinum so look out for that okay so once you do the camps you have to do the challenges okay? and then once you're done with your challenges so once you once you do that you have to do some of the races uh, I haven't spent too much too much time on that but I did spend uh, you know I did do a race or two uh, to try to receive a trophy and uh, you know Sometimes I, I had trouble figuring out where to go. Uh, pretty much if I if I fell behind, I was screwed. Uh, I had to kind of just restart the race because I wasn't going to catch up to them. So it's not something I look forward to. It's not something exciting. It's not something like, ooh, I'm, I'm excited to do my races after I'm done with everything. So, um, you know, those are my reasons on why I believe you should kind of skip this game, you know, because you're going to be doing hours on top of hours of, of grinding. Okay, uh, collect botan, you know, and I'm not, I'm not sure if that's something you like to do. Me, personally, I do not, so it's really up to you. Uh, plus, Mad Max, I don't necessarily see the platinum and say, ooh, what a nice platinum. You know, I kind of just see it like, oh, I guess this guy has a lot of patience or, you know, maybe has a lot of time. Maybe I just really, really enjoy the game and had to have the platinum. But I think overall what happens is that we kind of go into it and then not, know, not not necessarily understanding what we need to do and then once we're there we're just like uh almost done might as well just kind of you know work it out and just grind out the rest is the way i see it but uh, that leads me to the end of my video so hopefully i saved you some time hopefully i you know convinced you to kind of just kind of skip this platinum um if you're one like me that's playing through the game and regrets it just leave it in the comments below so that way we share with everybody else that i'm not lying about what i have to say um or if you're one to get the platinum, you want a platinum, and you think it's a special platinum, leave it in the comments below. I'd really appreciate it so that way we can have a discussion about that. But, uh, you know, like, subscribe, and, and God bless. Thank you.